Hi, I'm Alex Jung um, and we are Axel Motorsports and uh, we run the E-Racing GP Championships. E-Racing GP is a platform for simulator drivers or e-racing drivers in the region. Um, it's a platform supposed to be like a world-class platform to show drivers so they can show off how good they are. And a part of that also is to try and get them from the virtual world into the real world. Um, and our last year's winner in 2019 is a guy called Mio Hafis. And part of the prize of winning the E-Racing GP is a test with a professional race team. And that's what we're doing. So he's from the simulator, from the virtual world, and now we're back into the real world. And he's testing a Formula Renault 2.0 with Black Arts Racing. Nama saya Mior Mawafis bin Mior Lahmudin. Saya berumur 32 tahun. Saya berasal dari Puchong, Selangor. Saya sebenarnya bekerja sebagai penjual air Milo original di depan sekolah. Kali pertama yang merasa simulator ini pada pertengahan tahun 2016. Saya rasa wah ini macam ada feel macam betul kan ha, simulator kan? Ha. dari situlah saya mengenali ha, dunia sim racing yang sebenar so mio is exceptional at gt sport um, our competition last year was gt sport yeah mio dominated actually out of um, 700 drivers i think signed up to participate we got whittled down to 48 drivers and then 10 drivers, and uh, Muir was the champion. Um, he's very, very good in GT Sport. Saya memang tidak tahu percaya ada pak bok kita betul di Formula Renault. Berserang tu memang dikatakan teruk juga. <laughs> terus terang teruk. Masa first time keluar dari uh, pit lane tu, memang rasa buat macam kita biasa lah. Sebab uh, drive tu memang slow. <laughs> memang tak sabar lah. Sebab slow sangat buat time tu. Alex dari sini marah. Why you so slow? You hurt this car? My mind to say, aduh. <laughs> So we've had this test and he's done a pretty good job. His first laps were a little bit shaky to be honest. Uh, he spun twice on his outlap. So, okay, it was damp conditions and he was on slick tires. So may maybe we should have sent him out on wets as well. Um, so that knocked his confidence back a bit. But then since then, he's just been getting faster and faster. Uh, and he's doing pretty much as expected, which is pretty well. So Mio's first time in a single-seater Formula Renault um, is straight away better than 90% of the first-timers I've seen jump into these cars. Uh, they are very fast race cars and you need to really understand what you're doing. And then uh, after a net session, I beranikan uh, diri. Full throttle semua, uh, rem bagi naik sikit. Uh, masa full first line tu memang tak sampai rem pun dah naik gear lah. Ha, sebab kita tak tahu kan. First time drive sepang yang kita betul dengan tambah pula dengan Formula Renault. Memang uh, terus serang tergejut. Uh, sebab tak sangka dapat bawa kita betul dekat sepang pula tu. Memang rasa teruja, memang teruja tak sangat. Let's also not forget, Mio comes from very humble beginnings, you know, he lives in Puchong with his parents, his dad actually welded the rig for him, so he's got a very simple setup, and he's just got to this level, the best in Malaysia GT Sport, just by hours and hours of practice, and that's very inspiring to me, 
because it really shows anyone can do it. Because in motorsports, it's out of reach for most people, you know. But at least this way, you can get the simulator. You, if you put the hours in, if you win your races, there's a chance you can win prizes like this and get into the real world. What's next? You know, we have this prize. He wants some prize money. He got a test with a professional race car. But we'd love to keep him racing, you know, like, like, like a lot of our drivers out there. We're some very talented drivers here in Malaysia, and Muir's just one of them. So if we can get some sponsorship, get some more people interested, then maybe we can keep him in real racing full time. But for now, he's going to keep doing a simulator racing where he's winning lots of races all the time. And of course, if it, it wouldn't have happened without our sponsors, you know, I mean, Maybank, JD Sports, uh, U-Mobile, they really made this happen. Of course, Black Arts. Uh, they're the professional team, Asian F3 champions that are running the team today. So really, really thank you for all our partners for making this happen. I mean, it was a tricky day, huh? He's had a lot to learn, a lot to get over. I mean, he's never even seen this track before. Um, so it started off a bit shaky, Mio, you know, in the wet conditions and slick tires. Maybe it was a wrong idea. We should have sent you on the wet tires. Huh? So you spun two times. Uh, but after that, it was better, you know, because you could see each session you're going faster and faster and faster. And the last session, you were doing 14s, which is good. You know, I expected you to be doing 14s uh, today. Thank you for Alex Young. <laughs> no problem. Um, Black Art Racing. The, the motorsport yeah, people, motorsport the motorsport people. people. Okay, what do you say? From the scene to reality, just imagine.